The Rockford Ice Hawks close out their two game set against the Grand Rapids at Griffins tonight as they motor along on this three game road trip. Joseph Zakshewski with you alongside head coach Derek King for the Forest City Diagnostic Imaging Diagnosis of the game. And Coach King, we touched upon it a little bit at the end of Wednesday's contest. Big shootout win for the Ice Hawks here in Grand Rapids, but it seems like a win like that can do wonders for the confidence and the momentum of this group. Yeah, it <clears throat> definitely can. I mean, the, the, how we are right now as a lineup, you know, we got guys called up, guys injured. Got some guys up from uh, different places around North America, and they fit in well. And uh, I just think with that win like that, just shows that if we keep it close, we can we can uh, we give ourselves a chance, and that's what we did. It's a galvanizing moment for the group too. You touched upon it there. You even lose another player, Brandon Hagel, going up yeah. to the Chicago Blackhawks as a coaching staff. And I know I've asked you this a few times, but this roster continues to change for you. How challenging is it just to put that group together and 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 see success and get results when it, it's kind of a mishmash every single night? Well, it's a challenge, but I think we're starting to get get the hang of it now. We're we're, we're mixed matching lines. We're spreading the wealth. Uh, it's sometimes that hurts guys that have got a little chemistry as a line, but we got to you know we got to break them up just to get two or three solid lines. So uh, again, we'll bingo ball it. We'll, we'll get the, the lines we think that can uh, help us win tonight, and then we'll go from there. I saw last game you went with seven defensemen, 11 forwards. Looks like a similar setup for yeah. tonight. What's the strategy behind using that mentality in the attack against the Griffins? Well, there's games in between. They're not really, uh, you know, they had rest yesterday, so we can we can double up on uh, some of our top end guys and get them a little extra ice. and. You know, hopefully uh, they can, with those extra ice, we can create some more offense. But <clears throat> plus, we like to have Yowz in the lineup. He's good. Brandon Hagel gets the call up to Chicago. We touched upon it just a brief moment ago. How impressive are you with his game as of late first National Hockey League call up? Yeah. I know he was probably pretty excited to get that call yesterday, but uh, what have you seen from him? Well, he's relentless. He just, he, he's nonstop. It's not always perfect, but th the fact that he just does not stop and he quit, he doesn't quit on pucks. Uh, he might turn a puck over, but he still, he wants it back right away. And, He's just, he's got the skill, he's got the speed. I would love it for him to be 6'4", 230 pounds and throw lefts, but uh, you know, that's not him. But he, he plays like a big man and I'm happy for him. He's also carried a lot of the workload for this offensive opportunities yeah. for the Rockford Ice Dogs yeah. lately. How do you fill that gap? Well, it's hard, but that's why I got to shuffle the lines a little bit today and just kind of spread the wealth. And you know, hopefully guys, some of our call up guys uh, get that the knack of and just find the net tonight. Now the Ice Hawks taking on the Grand Rapids Griffins for the second consecutive contest. Shootout victory on Wednesday, but it's now a four-game winning streak you've had against this team. What is it about the Ice Hawks that seems to be bringing out the best of their abilities against the Central Division rival? Well, I like to win against my uh, buddy there, Benny Simon, so uh, that a little motivates the guy and myself. No, I, you know, it's just sometimes teams have the number on somebody. I, I don't know if we have their number. It's just maybe we're just getting the right right bounces at the right time, and hopefully we get the, the right bounces tonight. For the Rockford Ice Hawks, this is game three now of what is an impressive five game over seven day stretch, six over nine. It seems like when you look back at the season where the crunch time really comes in yeah. and, and the points are up for grabs, it's this week. How much does that play a factor into the, the, the speeches you give, the messages you send to this locker room? Well, it's the same. It's, uh, you know, redundant. We just keep pounding it in them. Just reminders. It's, it's not as much the video or the, the chalk talk. It's just little things, little details of the games. And uh, when we're doing a good job, we did it last game. We, we played the game right. We didn't cheat it. And that'll be the, the message tonight. Like, stick to, the, stick to the structure that we have, and then we, we should be okay. On a side note, Kevin Long going to get in the start today against Grand Rapids, but he had a nice honor from Finland yesterday. Role yeah. Model of the Year award, also part of the championship team as the sports phenomenon of the year. He seems like a pretty happy-go-lucky guy. What does that mean to him and, and to you in this locker room? Well, we're happy for him. He's he's done tremendous. Last year, kind of up and down and not sure where he was heading. And, uh, you know, maybe his game wasn't as solid as it was when he went to the Worlds. And he plays well there, and then he brings it right into camp and right into our season. So. Hats off to him. He's, he's stayed the course. He's uh, weathered the storm when he should have, and uh, now it's paying dividends for him. And now final thoughts going into tonight against Grand Rapids with Lonkin and Annette, the seventh defenseman, 11 forwards. What's going to be the biggest key to success? Well, just staying stay to the, the course. Stay the course. You know, we, we don't need to put on a show or anything. We just play our game and see what happens. Coach, I appreciate your time. Good luck tonight. Thank you. Head coach Derek King joining us for the Forest City Diagnostic Imaging Diagnosis of the game as the Ice Hogs and Griffiths rematch tonight at Van Andel Arena. Puck drop just moments away. You're listening and watching Rockford Ice Hogs Hockey on the Hogs Broadcast Network.